Okay, hi. So, today I'm gonna unbox my Ipsy box thing bag. And honestly, if you don't know what Ipsy is at this point, like, I'm not even gonna bother to explain it to you. Just go look it up. So, here's my bag, and it is a metallic pink, which I really like. And I think it... Yay! I don't have to... Yeah, okay. I realize that this unboxing is kinda sorta late, but I was in Thailand for the past two weeks, and I just got home, so that's why this is going to be uploaded late. I was kind of excited because when I saw my Ipsy package, it was, looked kind of fat, and my mom also gets Ipsy, but her package was like really thin, so I'm excited to see what's in here. I will say that I hope that I don't get the Pacifica eyeshadow, because no. And here's a little thing with all the people that yeah, okay, I don't know who those people are. You know, something I'm really surprised about is that Michelle Fawn isn't on this little card thing because Michelle Fawn, like, created Ipsy in the first place or something. So, here's the bag itself. I don't mind it. Like, I like it. Honestly, I haven't used my Ipsy bags for anything. They're literally sitting in my makeup drawer. But anyways, so first thing I'm going to pull out is... Uh... <laughs> the Milan and Goats Mojito Lip Balm. I like lip balm. I got a NYX lip balm from them like last week. I got a lip balm from them last Ipsy box and it was like a NYX butter balm, which honestly, like, at first I thought it was sheer, but I didn't like the color. But okay, I thought it was sheer at first, but then when I started putting it on, it turned like in this really weird nude color, and I don't really like nude lips. This doesn't smell like anything, and it's clear. This is actually clear. Okay. I like getting lip balm. Lip balm makes me happy, because my lips always seem to get chapped for some reason. I don't know why. Next thing. Ah, damn it! <laughs> the Pacifica Natural Mineral Coconut Eyeshadow in ethereal I was hoping I didn't okay honestly like I have one Pacifica eyeshadow duo that I got from Ipsy it was like purple and white but like I barely use it and the pigmentation on that like to build up is kind of hard let's see it's not even coming out of the box you know what it's it's this color yeah wow that is really bad there you go it's it's that color i don't know it kind of reminds me of like a browner version of urban decay's sin but i kind of don't want to struggle to get this out right now next thing i'm going to pull out oh it's in a bubble packet I got Pro Bell nail polish in the color into the blue. And you know, this is a nice color. Like I really like nail polish. Nail polish has kind of become my thing now. I'm in nursing school, so that's why my nails are bare. Um okay. I'll admit that like I've gotten okay, I've gotten two nail polishes from Ipsy before. At first I didn't like them because they were really thin, but then when I calmed my jets and like I like did a thin layer and build it up that way, then like it, they were really nice nail polishes. So I'm actually really happy about this nail polish. It's nice like a pastel cerulean color. I don't know. Next thing is, yay! I got a shadow brush from Elizabeth Moth. And I get really excited for shadow brushes. I can never have, I can never have enough brushes. Um, at first blush, like when I saw this online, I thought that this was a sugar pill brush and I was super excited, but then I discovered it wasn't a sugar pill brush and it was kind of sad, but still, um, I'm happy to receive this, um, brush. So, you know, kudos Ipsy, cause you do give us good brushes. And the last thing in my bag is... Hikari eyeliner in the color Storm. If this is black, so help me Cthulhu. 
Okay, so it's probably gonna be black. Oh. Uh. Oh, oh, okay. I see that I have a plastic thing around it. And it's not black, actually, it's silver. It's not showing up very well, but it's actually silver. Wow. That's not bad. Um, here's a small swatch I did on my hand. It's silver. Just trust me on that one. Uh, honestly? Okay, so Ipsy, I've kind of had a love-hate relationship with it for the past couple bags. But honestly, I really like this bag. I will give it a 4 out of 5. Like, genuinely. Like, honestly, this is the only thing. This eyeshadow is the only thing that I'm not really excited for because again the Pacifica eyeshadows have crappy pigmentation and because I am a fruit bat I watched Victoria Denelda and like she swatched it on her hand and it was kind of like a meh color but whatever I'm excited for my nail polish because like I just love nail polish I'm happy that I got an eyeshadow brush and I'll definitely end up using this I love lip balm a lot. <laughs> See, lip balm. Yes, there. And I'm actually, you know, this isn't bad. So, yeah, good job, Ipsy. Um, let's see. Wow, this is a pretty good bag. And side note, I'm driving back to school today. School starts on Monday so excited and yeah okay well thanks for watching bye